Hey gang. Well, I don't know if I've done a video from here yet or not, and uh, if I haven't, then, then well, you'll see this video getting uploaded before, uh, sometime this week. But this is the RVAC building, and it's been here for a long, long time. And I gotta say, in all honesty, um, this place used to be a great place to go to, and then all of a sudden, just like everything around here, suddenly things have to change. You have to, you have to kind of play by some new rules and things like that. It used to be a place you can come down to, go inside, get whatever items you need. You know, that could be clothing or toys or shoes or just books or anything like that. And it was like no problem getting it and everything like that. Nowadays, it seems like that the rules have changed. In fact, the rules have been changed. It seems like the rules change at this place about every two months. Sounds like a lot of places around here. And um, it used to be, you know, you can come in here, get your stuff, write down your name, county you're in, all that. And then you're gone. You're done. You got your purchases. Then all of a sudden they said, well, now you can only come in like once a week because this place used to be open twice a week, I think, or, or three times a week. Then it went down to two, twice a week. Now it's only open once a week. And the bad thing about it is, is that I feel bad for anybody who has to work here. They work one, one day a week, about four hours a week, and it's a non-profit organization. So I'm thinking like, gum, they can't be making much anything. If, I mean, anybody who works here, hopefully they're, <laughs> they're making some good money somewhere. Somewhere other than this town, I should say. But let's go up here to the doorway, and I'll show you some of the rules they have in this place real, real quick. Hopefully I can get a... If you can't see, them, uh, see a lot of the signs, I'll read them for, for you guys. Of course, we got uh, no smoking within 25 feet. Uh... We got this thing here. You can barely see it. it says uh, the Arvag Neighborhood Center now open on Tuesdays, eight to twelve. Donations are this, this, this. Of course, we got attention. Neighborhood Arvag is an important part of the the programs that Arvag offers to the nine counties. Da da da. Access the service number. Blah blah. Uh, please do not leave donations people still do that um we got up here are you age 60 or over yada 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 uh we do not have public restrooms um let's see if i can get to the one where we really need to uh uh awesomeness wanted okay look for more than just a job begin your adventure with us uh no loitering no tolerance and all this basically gang Pretty much what happened was, I, 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 I can never find the sign that uh, that had this, but basically, gang, what happened was, was that um, it kind of got to the point where you couldn't even, where now, now if you want to get anything from here, you got to go to the courthouse, sign a bunch of papers, find out when's a good time to come down here and all this other stuff. So it's, this place has really gone to, you know, where in a handbasket. And yet, still somehow, some way, this place gets business, but they give away free stuff. So again, I don't, I don't know. This place has has changed more times than I change my socks in a week. So yeah, it's it's a darn shame. This is what happened, but this is what happened. This is some of the stuff that goes on around this town. They got to change everything up every two months to do stuff to think it's going to improve business, and nine times out of ten, it doesn't. But I imagine the RVAC building is going to be here for a long, long, long time to come. But who knows? There's been people saying that it's in pretty bad shape. It's in bad ruin. And, uh, you know, there's other thrift stores around here that are making money because they're actually selling stuff. So I don't know. But those are just rumors. You know how rumors can be around these small towns. So I'm going to get on out of here, the gang. Thanks for watching, everybody. God bless you all. Hope you're having an awesome whatever time of day you watch this video. And I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like my videos, please feel free to subscribe. And uh, let's keep trying to help people out there who really, really need it right now. Do all you can to help out somebody you know that really needs your help. And let's stop trying to destroy the world. We've been doing enough damage to it for all these years since we've been here. And let's keep praying this virus nightmare is going to end very, very soon, despite what the government and media says, because I don't trust either one of them. So take care of yourselves. Try to be good. Try to be good yourself. Try to be good to others. Till we do this again, as always, stay strong. 
and rock on.